Hey guys, you're with me, Kevin, your scuba professional, and today we're here to review the all new Scuba Pro Go Sport fins that are in this funky box from Scuba Pro. So we're gonna unbox it, see what's going on inside, dive right in, and go through all the features of this really cool unit. So let's open it up. Let's pull that guy out of there. Oh, I got a fin, it's a white one, and I got another fin. Anything else in there? Nah, nothing. That can go. Alrighty, so let's check out the fins. First impression I can see this is looks really really similar to the Scuba Pro Go Travel Fin. The main difference however is the fact that it's got a really big foot pocket. So this one is designed to be worn with a boot. The Scuba Pro Go Travel Fin designed to be worn barefoot. So this is the travel version which you can wear with a boot. We were getting lots of requests from customers saying they really love the travel fin but they much prefer to cover their tootsies with a set of boots. So Scuba Pro have heeded the call and designed this fin. So to run through some of the features of it, it's a single piece of monoprene design, similar to that of the Scuba Pro Seaming Nova 2 and the Go Travel Fin. So it's a really solid, indestructible type of material. Guys will know that uh, Scuba Pro quite proudly take this unit, fold it up and park a car on top of it and it pops out the other side, everything all good. So almost indestructible. Looking at the back of the fin, you can see that it comes with this really funky bungee cord. You can pop that down and then your foot goes in over there. It comes in a variety of sizes. So you slide your foot in the pocket and then you pop this guy back up. Some of the funky things that Scuba Pro have done, very, very clever for those of us that are using and um, going diving on those bigger boats, is this little insignia over here. The Scuba Pro insignia is made of a special rubber, which is our high grip rubber. So if you're walking towards the back of the boat, this will stop you from slipping and falling on your Ollie, Charlie. So this is the best thing to have. If we turn the fin around, you can see some of the technology and the design has to do with the angle of attack that this fin comes out. Although it's quite a short and stubby fin, it is really really powerful as you fin down that angle of attack is really great and the fin carries on and when you fin up it's got a great angle of attack to scoop that water and pull it up it's got two really funky skegs on the front and these are detachable skegs they're designed to channel the water through just to keep it nice and uh, efficient you can replace these skegs and they come in a variety of different colors here's an example of a little color pack this is a nice cool silver pair but i've seen them in pink and blue and yellow and all sorts of funky it's available as an upgrade to the fin or as an individual product on our website um, turning over the back, you see it's got these really deep grooves down the side of the fin that gives us a lot of rigidity when you're finning around. They come in a pair, which is nice because most people have two feet. So it's a bit silly to sell one fin at a time. But they come in a pair and they are what we call omnifootical. So they can go on either or foot. Doesn't make a difference if it's right or left. These particular fins at the moment coming in either black or white. I'm sure they will add extra color options as they move forward and these will be added to our website as you need. So just uh, pay attention to that. And there's our review of the Scuba Pro Go Travel Fin or Go Sport Fin. It looks exactly like the Go Travel. You see they fit together nice and tight and snug, nice and stubby, making it easier for travel. A lot of my instructors have started using these for training as well because they're much shorter than the Seawing Nova Fin. Some of them even saying that they're getting better performance out of these there as opposed to the Seawing Novas because of the way the fin's designed. So they're really, really enjoying these. The fin's also designed by a South African bloke and manufactured in a tiny little little town called Rude Poort on the western end of Johannesburg, um, which is really cool, designed and made in South Africa, proudly South African product, but under license to Scuba Pro based in Italy and then shipped out around the world. So look out for the made in South Africa uh, sign at the bottom, something for us all to be proud of that some of these blokes are doing really, really well for diving. So there's my review of the Scuba Pro Go Sport Fin available from our website. If you guys are enjoying these product reviews, please feel free to subscribe to our YouTube channel or subscribe on our social channels. We've got all of them, the Instagrams, the Twitters, all the bits and bobs. Our main one being facebook.com forward slash scuba.co.za. And we'll keep you up to date with all of our trips and travels and all the cool things we do, as well as all the awesome deals that we offer on our website on an ongoing basis. So that's it from me guys, and I look forward to seeing you really soon in the water.